Hi, hello there YouTube and welcome back to another 25 days of Christmas. So I'm Random Ross and today uh, is day 11 and I'm going to review Mickey's Christmas Carol. So this is a take on A Christmas Carol, Charles Dickens classic, uh, reimagined and retold and performed by Mickey Mouse and Friends and it stars Scrooge McDuck as Ebenezer Scrooge, Mickey Mouse as Bob Cratchit, uh, uh, Donald Duck as Master Fred, Scrooge's nephew. Um, it also has Goofy as Jacob Marley, Jimmy D. Cricket as the Spirit of Christmas Past, um, Giant Willie, I don't know where you're going with that, as the Spirit of Christmas Present, and Pete as the Spirit of Christmas Future. And yeah, they cram uh, what is a supposedly a long story by Charles Dickens into a half an hour segment. So, let's get on to my likes and dislikes. So, you basically know the story of A Christmas Carol. Scrooge is a tight arse, he's a grumpy arse, he hates Christmas. He gets visited by free spirits. He's, he's his death and everything and he has a new lease on life and changes his ways. Uh, in this one, it's redone by Mickey Mouse and Friends. So, I liked uh, the animation. This was done in 1983 and aired on, the, I believe, the Disney Channel. Um, and um, we had Scrooge McDuck as Ebenezer. And I thought, yeah, he, he's probably best to play Scrooge. Uh, this was also my introduction to A Christmas Carol. I remember as a kid watching this and liking it. And yeah, this was like the first like take on A Christmas Carol I'd seen. Uh, this was also Disney's first adaption of the story as well. Uh, I like Mickey Mouse as Bob Cratchit, but again, Mickey Mouse didn't have lots of screen time in this. He was featured as a secondary role in this. And I feel really like that, you know, give another Disney Mickey Mouse character a bit of a, you know, more screen time in that. I thought, yeah, I like that. Uh, I also liked how the spirits were represented, how they got Jiminy Cricket back as uh, the spirit of Christmas past, and he showed um, Scrooge the past and everything. The past segments were good as well. Uh, it featured Daisy Duck, and we even got Minnie Mouse in there as Bob Cratchit's wife, and we got, you know, a Tiny Tim. Um, and yeah, I, I liked how, you know, you know, this was my first fun, my first real look at A Christmas Carol. Um, my dislikes, I guess I don't like how rushed uh, the second act was. See, um, when we go to the second spirit, Spirit of Christmas pra uh, Present, uh, we get um, Giant Willy from another adaptation of, of another tale, Mickey and the Beanstalk, I believe. And his time in it is very rushed. It's like he is a giant and he shows Scrooge what's going on at Bob Cratchit's house. And then that's it. And then we go into the future with the third spirit, but played by Pete, who doesn't say much. And he's wearing a robe and smoking a cigar. And we just see Scrooge in the graveyard and we see that Tiny Tim's dead. And, and then he gets shown his own grave and everything. I feel like those two segments were very rushed and I mean they did this in a half hour sure and I feel half an hour wasn't enough maybe if they stretched it to an hour it would be good but I don't know whether it was budget, you know, re budget reasons or, or time or whatever I don't know but this could have done with going on a little bit longer instead of being you know crammed into half an hour I feel they could have done so much more with the other two spirits uh, but you know other than that I do enjoy this one and I think it is available on Disney Plus so what am I going to rate this one now uh, I think I'll give this I'll give it a three I think I'll give this one a three out of five today and yeah so that's it for my review of today Mickey's Christmas Carol have you seen this one let me know down in the comments below uh, if you like this video be sure to give it a big thumbs up share with your friends feel free to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and to hit that notification bell I have two other channels which are linked in the cards above or down below. If any of them interest you, feel free to check them out. So now, to see us out, we have Stephen Carroll. Stephen, do your stuff. So, uh, you know, like Christmas time, I always like to see snow. 
Yeah, I remember one time in the winter time, it wasn't exactly Christmas, it snowed. And ever since, and when it snowed, my missus, she did nothing but look through the window. I thought if it got any worse, I'd have to let her in. <laughs> ah yeah, let you get that. I got another thing as well, Christmassy song, that Mariah Carey song, All I Want For Christmas Is You. She just wants Santa. Why does she want an old bloke like that? Hey, hey, a bit, a bit of a stalkerish thing, that, isn't it? Yeah, I don't know if I'm overthinking it or not, but ah, you know what it means. Anyway, I'll be seeing you later, ta-ra.